Federal investigation just being launched into General Motors, looking into the company's failure to address deadly safety issues before a recent massive recall. ABC's Rebecca Jarvis has that story. This morning, the largest automaker in the country, General Motors, facing a congressional investigation, and ABC News has learned a federal probe into what it knew and when about its recent ignition switch recall, though neither GM nor the U.S. attorney has officially confirmed the probe. The potentially fatal flaw linked to at least 13 deaths and 31 crashes, among them this 2005 crash in Maryland that killed 16-year-old Amber Marie Rose. They had no apology to us. They didn't say anything. The problem, the ignition, which could turn off unexpectedly, shutting down the car's power and safety systems, including the airbag. GM says a heavy keychain or even rough roads could cause it. Last month, GM announcing a recall of 1.6 million cars from model years 2003 to 2007, including the Chevy Cobalt, Pontiac Solstice, and Saturn Ion. GM's new CEO, Mary Barra, says she's conducting an internal review. I do think that Mary Barra wants to make up for uh, the mistakes of the past, but she's got a lot to make up for. For Good Morning America, Rebecca Jarvis, ABC News, New York.